My name is Stefan Kurten. I'm Executive Director of EBU Eurovision. Uh, I'm responsible for all the rights acquisition that the EBU is doing. The EBU is an organization that uh, takes care of more than 70 members in more than 50 territories and we are one of the major players in the sports rights acquisition industry. Talking from a European perspective, I'm quite convinced that one of the major issues is to get the support from the public. Uh, we have seen that in a couple of European cities or even regions, the support was not given. Uh, actually, people voted against these big events. So there is a major step forward to um, convince the public that there is an advantage. But it's, only, it's not only policy and communication, I think it's more. You have also to have good arguments uh, in order to support the idea. That, I think, is one of the first challenges. The second challenge, clearly, um, is that you have to organize yourself. We are very federal in our, we are very regional in our structure. And um, we clearly see that we are competing with, let's say, the Chinese or the Americans, uh, or let's say, big groups which are well organized. And and in this respect, uh, our approach to go city by city might sometimes be challenging. So a better alignment in Europe might be helpful for the bigger events. So when I just look at our business uh, and how we in future operate, I think there are enormous challenges and uh, changes also to the modus operandi, to the way how we operate foreseeable. Uh, today we need big IBCs, or let's say yesterday we needed big IBCs, international broadcast centers, where thousands of people, let's say for Olympics, like 10,000, 15,000 people, journalists, media were uh, gathering. I think in future we will work with remote control, we will have remote work, so in this respect there are huge changes for the host city, but also really major changes for us as broadcasters to be seen. Nobody today in this kind of quickly changing environment could ever think of doing it all on your own. You have to rely on partners, you have to permanently talk, speak, communicate, discuss and discover new opportunities. Uh, test it and then live it. So partnership is a must. Well, I think it's good to have uh, the stakeholders because I deeply believe in sharing. I think it's extremely good, A, that the broadcasters are invited, B, that we as broadcasters understand the needs of the host cities, and that is something which we clearly have to push forward, in particular, as, as I've said, technical developments are asking for more and more and closer cooperation. We also have to share content. We have to support the cities uh, to allow them to promote themselves because we are relying on them. So in this respect, I think host city is a great event and it should be continued.